Hello guys, this is Asif and in this tutorial we are going to see how we can manage table spaces in Oracle database. So let's get started and see what we have got in Oracle database. Select name from p dollar table space. These are the table spaces which are already available in the database. So if I say create table space or first I will verify what is the location of data files select name from the dollar data file this is the location of data files so I would recommend that it our new table space should also have the data file in the same location for easy management of the database create table space I will name it as my TBS data file So the table space has been created. Name of the table space is my TBS. This table space consists of only a single data file whose size is only 100 MB. So I will say select TS number name from V$ dollar space oracle has allocated number six to our table space number six is the table space number so i will say select ts number name from data file so you can see this table space whose number is number six has got only one data file who is my tbs01 so if i want to add another data file into this table space what i will do alter table space g my tbs So I have added a uh, one more data file into my table space. Now our table space consists of two data files. I will verify it. So here you can see now table space number six consists of two data files. Let's proceed further and drop the data file which we have just added. Alter table space my tps drop data file data So date table space has been altered, date data file has been dropped. So let's continue and see what else we can do with 
our table space so suppose if i want to view the information about the table spaces i have got one table a uh, one one view which provides information about the table spaces tpa describe tpa this is the view db underscore table spaces which provides us information about the table spaces so if i say it will provide us information some more information is also available here and i have just added this file whose size was 100 mb suppose if i want to increase the size of this data file whose name is my tbs 001 my tbs 01.tbf i will issue another statement alter database data file i tps 01.tpf resize to 10m or this size to 200m so if i see describe p dollar data file select name bytes 024 from p dollar the file so here you can see the file size has been increased from 100 MB to 200 MB. So let's proceed further and see how we can drop a table space or how we can make the table space read only. So if I say alter table space my TPS read only it will be made read only if i want to make it read write alter space my tps read write so this is how you can alter the table space and this is the view db underscore table spaces from where you can view the information about the table space and find out whether your table space is read only or read write and if i want to force the logging of on the table space i will issue the command alter table space my tps force logging alter table space my tps no logging so this is how i can manage the table space and then if i want to rename my table space i will issue the command alter alter table space my tps rename to your tps select name from p p dollar table space your tps then i will change it again alter table space my your tps to my t 
PBS your TPS to my TPS here we go so this is how you can uh, manage the table space and this is how you can alter the table space make it read only read write you can add a file into the table space you can drop a file from the table space you can view the information in, uh, in about the table space and finally i will tell you how you can drop the table space which you have just created drop table space my tbs this will drop the table space and if you want to drop the table space as well as the files which we have created you will issue alter ta drop table space <coughs> drop table space my tbs including data files including contents and data files so this is how you will do it so i'll just execute the command and if i will verify it again name from v dollar table space it should be gone so that's all about uh, how to create the table space and how to drop the table space along with managing the table spaces thank you very much for watching